Hello and welcome to In the Kitchen with Matt. I am your host, Matt Taylor. Today, we are gonna make amazing blueberry muffins from scratch. Let's get started. For the tools and the ingredients, we have a wire whisk, a rubber spatula, a fork, we have a muffin pan with paper cups. For the topping, we have one quarter cup of softened butter. We have one half cup of white sugar. We have one third cup of all-purpose flour. We have a bowl that we're gonna mix all that in. And we also have one and a half teaspoons of ground cinnamon. And all of that will be mixed together in this bowl to go on the top. For the batter, we have one and a half cups of all-purpose flour. We have two tablespoons of baking powder. We have one half teaspoon of salt. We have one cup of fresh blueberries, three-fourths cups of granulated sugar, one large egg, one-third cup of canola oil, and one-third cup of milk. And then we have a large bowl that we're gonna mix it all together. Okay, first let's preheat the oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set this bowl aside. I'm gonna grab my flour. I'm gonna take my salt and put it in there. My baking powder. And then I'm just going to give this a little whisk. You could use a bigger bowl for this. Okay, I'm gonna set that aside. And now, in our large bowl here, let's go ahead and put our egg in there. Add our oil. Add our milk. Okay, and we'll take, take our whisk and we're gonna whisk this all together. Okay, now let's take our sugar. Put that in there. Whisk that together. Okay, and now we're gonna start adding the flour and I'm gonna add it about a third at a time. Okay, another third. And then our final third. You can also use a wooden spoon for this. Or a hand mixer. Make sure we get it all off of our whisk so we don't waste any. And then take a spatula. Let's scrape the sides. And now what we wanna do is we wanna just fold in our blueberries. We'll just fold them in. Looking great. And you can add more blueberries if you want or less. Totally up to you. All right. And now what we wanna do is we wanna put our batter inside of our paper cups. Set this aside. And depending on how big you want your muffins is how much we're gonna fill it up. You can fill it up all the way to the top so it uh, creates a big top, or you can fill it two thirds full. Okay, I actually got a large spoon here to help us to get an even amount of batter on each one. And then what you do is you just take some and we'll just scoop it in like that. That one's gonna be a large one. And then one thing we wanna do is we wanna make sure to scrape our bowl so we can get all the batter out so we're not wasting any of it. And the rubber spatula, spatula works really good for this. And just, you can just use the extra and fill up any ones that are a little light. So this recipe will make nine large muffins or about 12 medium-sized muffins. Okay, and I'm gonna set this aside. I'm gonna take this bowl and I'm gonna add flour. That's one third cup of flour, one and a half teaspoons of cinnamon, one half cup of sugar, and we're gonna add our quarter cup of softened butter. And we're gonna mix this all together, make our crumble that's gonna go on the top. 
So just using our fork, let's just mix it all together. You can also come in here with your hands and just mix it all together like that. It works really good too. And then we'll just grab a little bit of it and we'll just sprinkle it on top. Like that. And you can put as much or as little of this as you want on top. Okay, and then you bake this at 400 degrees for 20 to 25 minutes. And when they come out of the oven, they will look like this. All right, our blueberry muffins are done. They look amazing, they smell amazing, super easy to make. If I can make them, you can make them. I'm Matt Taylor. This has been another episode of In the Kitchen with Matt. Thank you for joining me. If you have any questions or comments, put them down below and I'll get back to you. Don't forget to subscribe. Take care. Time for me to dive into one of these. Let me go after this one. Ooh, yeah. Thank you.